Hello everyone, I'm Rob Smith with Smiths in Black and finally Fed Day is upon us. And so what we're going to be looking for here is, you know, how do the different series of broadening formations play out? So, you know, you'll hear us talk about continuity. And so uh, event continuity is when th that announcement comes out. Are we trading higher or lower from when that announcement comes out? That's something I'm going to want to know about for a while. So you can see this broadening formation here on the daily. So the question is, do we come ripping back through here or do we try to expand that weekly? three two down so you're just doji on the week so far and we still are rev strat month to the downside here and it's getting a little redder so uh should be interesting tomorrow uh qqq also two two down on the month and your daily here you can see these lower lows here and these higher highs so the question is do we expand all this kind of stuff because if we go back to that spy 60 you're gonna see all these series in here and here's the SPY 60 series. How do we get out of this? All right? Do we? That's something we really want to know about. So even though it's been pretty boring here waiting for this, if you just wait, you'll see this here. This was a two down, and then this was a two up. These two became an outside bar of that. So you didn't have that much magnitude. It was just to take this out. So when it started to retreat at all, you just get out. Then two up to down reversal, and if that works, we're going to go look to take all these guys out, which we did. Then, to down, to up, and I know people were asking me today, they're like, well, if it's still red on the day, can I take this 60? I'm like, this is part of exhaustion risk. You took out the lows, you stopped everybody out, and then the sellers didn't step down. So, 2-2 two, two reversal back up. So, you know, Fed is pretty much the uh, the thing, so we'll let, let them open. Uh, crude, uh, if anything, there was a concentration of inside days in crude. Crude itself, XLE, OIH, uh, EOG, so a whole bunch of those uh, to keep an eye on. Uh, we got an energy number coming out tomorrow morning, so we'll see. If we go to Netflix, here, Shooter Counters Hammer and Potential back into this broadening formation. That's something I'd want to know about. Uh, if we go to MetaBuddy, RevStrat Day, if they want to keep puking this thing, because right now, this month, still inside, inside month to the downside. And they got exhaustion risk by going into the lows, but it's still red. So uh, we'll see how that goes. And Apple actually looking a little better here. And Apple, on the daily, see this broadening formation here. So Apple looking a little better. However, you did take out this high. The question is going to be strong enough for that. Where do you go two up, two down, and see you later? So uh, we'll let them open. We'll uh, check out uh, what they do with these energy numbers. And then 75 or 100, that's what we've been waiting for for so long, but we're going to find out. All right, that's going to do it for today. I'm Ross Smith, Smith the Black, the Nightly Vid.